What's good with y'all man, welcome back to another video. Now look, the combos I'm showing y'all on the screen right now, I'm not going to be putting them in this dribble tutorial. Why? Because I don't know if these are the best six to do these little glitch moves, so I'm going to just do the moves that I know for sure will not change, you know. So if you don't know what you are doing at all, you are completely oblivious, you don't know how to do whoopties, behind the backs, momentum, all that stuff, I'm going to show you big fella. So, you prepare for that get ready have a lot of patience don't click off the video if you get frustrated you just gotta yo take a breather sip on some tea or something and get back into it okay you gotta become a god all right so good luck to everybody let's get into it now the first combo we're gonna be doing is momentum it's literally been in the game for like four years and you still don't know how to do it but hey i'm about to tell you right now so I'm going to just explain it with the ball in the right hand. So you got the ball in your right hand. You're going to hold R2. Once you're holding R2, you're going to flick your right stick to the left. And as soon as you flick your right stick to the left, you're going to point your left stick to the left. So basically, hold R2, flick to the left or right, and point your left stick in the same way that you flick your right stick. Complicated. It sounds like that, but it's really not. Make sure you get this move down before you proceed to the next one. Now this combo is called Momentum Crossover. It's basically like the OP version of the Whoopty this year because they kind of patched the Whoopty, but you know, I'll get in that later. But to do this combo, you're going to do a momentum and then you're going to move your left stick to the top left or the top right and then you're going to flick left or right. Now in my case, I'm doing momentum from the left to the right. So my left stick is going to be pointing to the right. Okay, so I'm going to move it to the top left and then I'm gonna flick left on the right stick. I got it slowed down, but this is as simple as I can get. I know it doesn't show my left stick like doing what I'm saying, but that's literally the controller on the screen, like the little app I'm using. It's not the best, man, but I'm trying. So the next combo we're gonna be doing is momentum spin. There's literally so many ways to trigger it. It just, you gotta do a little, you know, similar motion with your right stick every time. Basically, if you do, middle right of your right stick to middle left of your right stick going down so you're basically like doing a, a letter u shape on your right stick after a momentum you will do it that's literally all you're doing now i know on my controller it shows me rotating from the bottom to the top left you could do that too i'm telling you it triggers like every time it just it's not hard at all super easy combo all you gotta do is do like a little c shape or a U shape on your right stick and you will do a momentum spin. Literally one of the easiest combos ever. If you cannot learn it, bruh, get help or something. Like I, I don't know how to make it easy. This combo is momentum behind the back. Same thing as last year, basically. You guys remember that moving crossover combo that I showed you just like a couple moves ago? Same thing as that. You momentum, point your left stick straight up to the top left or the top right, depending on which way you momentum, just to make it easier. You can you can point it straight up if you want, but once you point your left stick straight up, you just flick down on the right stick, and boom, you have momentum behind the back. Once again, is in the slowest possible way I can show you. If you can't get it, be patient. It does give you some weird animations at times, so you know, don't worry if you're messing up. Everyone messes up sometimes. Now we're moving into sham guys. There's like a whole bunch of different versions, but literally all you do is you have the ball in your left hand, you're gonna flick left, and then you're gonna flick right. Super fast, by the way, you gotta do super fast. Now that's the first kind of sham god. The second kind of sham god, you start a speed boost and then you just stop. You just literally let go of every single button on your controller and he'll do a little pullback animation. Now to do the one that you're running just straight forward in, you're just gonna be running forward, tap left, right, or right left depending on what ball you got the hand in and that's it now we're gonna get into behind the backs behind the backs this year are a little different only difference is you just hold r2 when you do them so if you got the ball in your left hand you're gonna hold r2 you're gonna flick down on the right stick and then you're gonna point the left stick to the top right simple very simple and if you want to do a sham god the move i'm doing right now you do it behind the back and then you just stop let go of everything just stop moving and he'll do the sham guy. You guys probably wondering, oh, I think they took out Trey Young this year. No, it's literally just weird for some reason. You do it between the legs without holding R2, so you flick bottom left or bottom right, 
and then you hold R2 after you did the between the legs and then flick down and you'll do the Trey Young animation obviously this is Van Fleet the dribble god in the prelude so it's not really Trey Young but when the game comes out you can get Trey Young that's how you do Trey Young <laughs> now we're gonna get into the whoopty now warning whoopty is not the same as it is last year because last year it was way more lethal but this year it's like it's like great value version but this is how you do it you want to hold r2 then this is ball in right hand you want to hold r2 flick down on the right stick and as soon as you do that point your left stick to the top right and you'll do it now if you want to do the whoopty you just keep running straight and then flick left that's it and if you want to do a ball in your left hand you're going to hold r2 flick down and then you're going to point the left stick to the left and then you're going to keep running forward and you're going to flick the right stick to the right boom you are now doing great value whoopty now there is the real whoopty in the game but it's very hard to do and i don't know if i have the right sig so i'm gonna just wait till the advanced tutorial but that's gonna wrap up this video if you guys did enjoy if you did help you make sure to leave a like and subscribe i'm gonna be doing advanced tutorials whenever 2k20 drops for sure and i'm gonna make those videos super long so i can break down all the cheese to you obviously i'm not gonna give you all the cheese because then everyone's gonna replace me i can't do that okay but i'm sure there's some guy out there that's literally releasing everything but last year both my dribble tours got like 500k so apparently i'm pretty good at these so if you guys did enjoy if it did help you make sure to leave a like and share it to your friends who literally suck at dribbling this is a super basic tutorial to get them warmed up for 2k20 get them ready for the advanced tutorial and i'm gonna end the video on this i made a new build so that old video that people seen that guard build that build is fire it is awesome but after some thinking i was like i'd rather have defense badges than inside so i revamped it a bit and i made a way more rounded player he can literally do everything he can do inside play defense break your ankles shoot from limitless all that good stuff i'll have that build video before 2k20 comes out for sure and yeah i'm gonna stop wasting time hope you have a blessed day leave a like share the video if you did learn something you feel me that's all i got for you be your boy g-man